The first thing we've got to do, and I'm going to use a particular purpose statement as an example, break it down into three units, is firstly establish the conceptual verb. The conceptual verb is a word like investigate. There are hundreds of them, and we will give more examples later, but it establishes what you are trying to do conceptually with this report. And in this case, the report is investigating. If you don't have a conceptual verb, you won't be sure about what you're doing. Secondly, there must be some kind of mini scope. I've obviously changed names here to protect uh, the innocent. But this report investigates the XYZ wastewater treatment works, clearly the sewage works of a township or a settlement west of somewhere. And that would be a mini scope. So, so far we have a conceptual verb, we have a mini scope. And then finally, in terms of capacity and ability to treat the sewage demands of the growing population. Clearly the settlement has a growing population and the sewage works are not working out well. So what's happening here is this report is investigating the wastewater treatment works and working out whether or not it has the capacity to deal with the growing population. Notice thirdly here what happens is that we can establish what we call a mini hypothesis which is an envisaged outcome of this report. You don't know the outcomes of this report, but if I were to use my imagination, they would include, for example, the wastewater treatment work does not have the proper capacity, or the wastewater treatment work does have the capacity. So this is a very good purpose statement. It has established the conceptual verb, a scope, and the possibility of hypotheses or conclusions. The criteria, therefore, for a good purpose statement include, firstly, the conceptual verb, the mini-scope, and many hypotheses Here's another one. This report investigates the condition of bridges in the ABC province with a view to compiling an organization and maintenance program. Very clear. The same kind of thing. We've used the word investigates twice, but that's fine. Need help with your report? We can help you construct this report. Contact us at info at insight-ed.co.za. We will walk you through the creation of your report.